Hello and good morning. It's 838. Greg Terrelly and Al KG Mornings for Kip Scott GMC Cadillac Buick. It's on the way Sunday, May 4th. Oh, where is my Star Wars music? Allie is here from Kids Help Phone. Good morning, Allie. Good morning. Good to see you. Yeah, good to see you. So we've been tirelessly working uh, with a legion of volunteers. Yes. I think a legion is probably the wrong word. because I think you're right. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's more like five. It's a small but <laughs> mighty squad to put on this walk so kids can talk. That's what we call it nationwide, presented by BMO. But here in Red Deer, we thought we'd have a little more fun with it, and we're calling it the Mighty Three Mile Mosey, or whatever you can manage. Yep, that's right. And the kind of the idea, I guess, is so that we can involve senior citizens, young children, moms, run club members, whoever. Yeah, exactly. We like to get everybody involved. Kids Help Phone affects absolutely everybody in the community. So if you've got a youngster under the age of 21, they are welcome to call in. So this is specifically fundraising for our counselors who we pay for through fundraising. We are a solely fundraised uh, organization. We don't get any core uh, funding no funding or from anything. the government. Yeah, nothing. Yeah. So we had the opportunity to be at a presentation, and uh, these guys did presentations at the high schools as well, uh, with actual counselors from Toronto who answer the phones on a daily basis, and they were fascinating people. Yeah, they were. They're awesome. And, and some of the, you know, some of the stories very positive, some heartbreaking. Uh, this is what they're dealing with every day, and a tremendous amount of call volume comes from our area. Yes, about 500 calls a week we get in Ontario from central Alberta alone. Yeah, and these are just kids from various struggles or just need uh, an outlet somewhere, need a, a shoulder, need an ear. And that's what they provide. And they're all trained, so they know how to steer them towards the right path, which is amazing. The walk is to support child and youth mental health and well-being. It's happening. Mackenzie Trails this is a beautiful spot. Yes, it is. I love it out there. We've got lots of area. We're going to have a band playing or a couple bands, actually, and yeah. have a five kilometer walk route, walk out past 67th Street, a whole bunch of things going on. Jamie Woodfin is, uh, well, 99% confirmed uh, to be on that stage that day and uh, he won a guitar from us recently uh, oh really yeah an autographed <laughs> travis Tritt guitar at the uh, 40th anniversary concert so you never know you might break that out for the big uh, event that would be awesome registration is at 11 o'clock and this is a question i phoned you about yesterday uh are we able to register on site or would you prefer people to pre-register with their teams? Preferably, obviously, to pre-register at walksokidscantalk.ca, but we do, obviously, people will just show up on the day of, which is fine too. But if you do it beforehand, you can get donations right online. They accept all forms of payment and you can take all your money and cash into BMO as well and they'll put it right into your team. So if you volunteer or register before the walk, then that's obviously the best. <laughs> are we still looking for volunteers? Oh, always, yeah. We always are looking for volunteers on the day of so and for our committee members as well i just had something with darth vader that's not what i wanted i wanted this yes <laughs> sunday may 4th <laughs> may the force be with us all for the three mile mosey and moseying can be anything you want you can do a fast mosey and run or you can do my traditional mosey which is more of an amble yeah or you can check out uh, uh spandy andy's mosey as well on our facebook and twitter pages yeah absolutely <laughs> check out the facebook and twitter for all the info ali thanks very much no problem